Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to quickly show you guys my I'm running latest book to work makeup routine. Basically what I do when I need to get out of the house like in 10 minutes. Okay, so I'm going to start with my favorite primer. Pretty sure I've already talked about this. I'm pretty sure it was in the empties video and the favorites video. But yeah. Oh yeah, I don't really take this out. Because I don't like to get makeup in it. I used to just like do my makeup while I had it in, but then um, I had to change it a lot because there was just foundation getting caked in it and it was just gross. You could not see the rhinestone anymore, so I just kind of just take it out every time I wash my face. Every time I do my makeup, um, when I do a face mask, I just take it out because honestly, it kind of feels good not to have it in. Like it just feels like a break. You know, like that feeling when you take off your retainer. I don't know why, but it, it feels good when I have it out. Okay, so I haven't, um, I know this is like my quick routine, um, but... In a, honestly, in a long time, I haven't really worn a lot of foundation. I kind of just been resorting to this one. It's just concealer. It's from um, LA Girl Pore Concealer. I think it's in the shade Porcelain. I'm not sure I like the shade, but I really like this um, concealer. It, it was really cheap. I got it from... Ulta, I think they had like a deal, buy one, get one, 50% off for free or something. So that's why I was like, oh yeah, I'll try it. Because I got it with foundation, and I don't like the foundation. But, but um, well, the foundation actually isn't bad, but um, the smell of it, it's weird. I don't like it. But anyway, so I just put this everywhere. I'm breaking out really bad. But yeah, I just put this on everywhere, and I'll use my Real Techniques foundation brush. Um, I love this thing. I love everything from Real, Real Techniques. I have a couple of things, but yeah, I normally would use my um, sponge because I have like three Real Real Technique beauty sponges, I don't know what they're actually called, but I feel like it takes so much longer to use a sponge now. For some reason, I used to always, it used to always be my, like, go-to, but, um, I don't know, I just, I feel like it doesn't help when I'm actually in a rush. I do feel like this concealer could um, use a little bit more coverage. So if anybody um, just uses concealer on a regular basis more than foundation and it like covers pretty good, you should tell me what it is because I, I normally just go for the cheap brand and I don't really branch out to anything else because I don't know what to try. I almost can't tell if it anything. Definitely got some dry skin right there. Okay, so I also go in with this concealer. It is Be Bright Illuminate Concealer in the shade Light. It's from this brand. I showed you guys their lipstick in one Ipsy bag unboxing or opening or something. I don't think I showed you guys this one. Because I stopped showing um, my Ipsy reviews, but um, I got this one in there, and I really, really like it. But it's like the co the color is really good. It's just it's a really thin concealer, so like you definitely couldn't like use it by itself. So like I just like to go over it because it's a little bit lighter than that porcelain, which is weird. Because I'm pretty sure porcelain is supposed to be the like the lightest, right? I don't know. 
I've never had to buy a blush from Rokor. But yeah, I just like, I just do the same thing, just not as much. Maybe I, I did put a lot, but this is just what I do. something in my eyeball but anyways I've been sick and um I'm like recovering I just like I can't get up early on time I can't like like this is like my second day being like running late I'm not I haven't been late but like running at the door late and um I have no videos pre-recorded like I'm just still weak and like I feel like I'm still recovering and I'm not even sick anymore. I mean my cough is like very minimum. I I do it every now and then. But for the most part I feel pretty normal. I just wish my body would like, you know, catch up and you know, get the shit together. Okay, so I'm gonna um I already opened it. So I'm gonna use the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in the shade Light Fair. But anyway, so I'm going to take my Real Technique Multitask Brush. That's an interesting name. This is one of my favorites too. But I just like to stick it on there like this. in my eyeball yeah I just do this and then I'll move on to my eyebrows but but yeah so I'm just trying to like catch up from being sick I feel weird like I just don't have any record like videos just pre-recorded like I normally do it's so weird so I don't know I do have like a lot of stuff coming I don't just I just don't know like when it's gonna happen now because I feel like I just I did oh my god this coffee I didn't take any time off I still uploaded I just feel behind because I don't have one like normally the day I upload like it's already ready because I finished it like days before you know and so now I'm just like oh this is so weird because today is Wednesday, and I upload on Wednesdays and Fridays, and um, when I look that way, it doesn't look blended. But um, yeah, so it's weird that I have I'm doing a video the day I need to upload. But anyway, so I'm gonna do my brows, and I have the Milani Stay Put Color Brow or something in this shade Soft Brown. It's like their lightest shade. With or blonde and it's still too dark I switched to that one I have from itsy but I'm running really low and I actually really like it because it's not as dark but um I'm just gonna switch back and forth now because I don't want to run out of it because I don't really know where to find it because I got it from itsy and it's not like a known brand but I should do that, that one before I used it for like a hot minute It's crazy dark or am I tripping? I don't know. But yeah, I was saying like today is Wednesday, so I wonder if I'll be able to get it done today. After work, I do have alterations for my wedding dress. So I won't be coming home right away. So it's really exciting. Yesterday I went back to the venue. And I got the floor plan so we can figure out where the tables are going to go. And like where I can put decorations and like stuff like that. And then um, we have to get the guy's suits. And we're almost done you guys. Like today is, oh today's August. Today's the 1st of August I'm pretty sure. Um, but... There is always one thicker eyebrow, and I just, I don't know how to fix it. 
But what I like to do after I do my eyebrows is let it sit and then move on. And then I brush it out. I really wish I was into like concealing it and but I just don't care enough. I just want to be able to look like I have eyebrows. Yeah. But anyway, so today's August 1st, right? Like, or am I wrong? I don't know. I'm pretty sure I'm right. And this year was the 31st. But, um, I'm just going to take all the powder off now. But, um, which means mine and the ribbon's anniversary is in 19 days. It's on the 20th. And we'll be together for eight years. I just, holy crap. And then, um, so our anniversary is this month. And then September, October, two months after that, we're getting married. Like, it's happening so fast. I need to do a video for you guys for my, um, uh, my decorations maybe. I don't know. I need to do something else. Because it is coming up so fast. It is crazy. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is a little bit of contour. Just a little bit because look how white I am. Um, this I got from my Ipsy bag. It's in the shade, it's bronzer in the shade Bora Bora from Paula Dorf. I don't know. I thought it was going to be way too dark, so I go super easy on it. I'm going to use my Eco... I don't know because it's so old it's like completely faded but I'm gonna use this brush it's like a tapered one so I'm gonna use this I literally go super light on it and I just like give myself color pretty much I just can't believe the wedding is coming so fast. I really need, I really want Ruben to come on my um, channel already, but time is just flying. Uh, we always are doing something now. It's crazy. I don't like to be perfect. I just like want to make not look so blinding white. So then I'm going to take my blush. I actually really, really like this one. Um, I got into blush a while ago. It's hard to find one that I actually like because they're just like strange colors to my, in my opinion. They're just like a little, like I'm really white. So like I need like not a dark shade, you know. But this came in also in my Ipsy bag and it's from, pretty sure I have something else from them. Um, I don't know how to say it, but Skin Blush, I think is the shade. It looks a lot darker than what it says, but I take the same brush and I literally gently do it and then I just, you know, give myself some color because I am so white. pretty sure that's okay so we'll see I'm just gonna pull this off okay. um okay so I have one more thing to do but I'm gonna go ahead and brush my eyebrows out I feel like I let them sit long enough I like to let them dry before I brush them so that way the product doesn't move around I guess Really bugs me that one is super thicker, but whatever. Anyway, so I'm gonna take my favorite freaking highlighter. You guys already know it's the Elf one. It's so old. It's in Moonlight Pearl. Yeah, Moonlight Pearls. It's from Elf. I. It's in every fucking makeup video I do. You guys already know I like this. I'm gonna take my Eco. Don't know what it is because it's old. I'm going to take this little tiny eco brush and I'm just going to, what is happening? Oh, somebody's hooked up. 
I just throw it on, honestly. Yeah. And then sometimes I'll put um, mascara on, so I'll just throw a little on. I'm not a huge fan of mascara down here because I just end up getting it everywhere, so... I like the natural look because I like my lashes, like, the way it is right now. They're, they're like, thin, not too long. I can wear glasses with them, and, like, they won't get in the way, you know? But, yeah, so that's as, like, light as mascara I want to go. But, anyway, so, put my ring back on. I take this off the same time I take this off so I don't forget either one. Because if I walk out without my ring or without my nose stud, I can feel something missing on me. So I take them off at the same time. And then I just put this baby back in here. And then I'm um, ready to go. Oh, also a tip. If you run late a lot like me, braid your hair at night so I only wake up you have curly hair. But anyway, that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And until next time, bye guys.